so this is what the guy said real quick before we start the next round. He said, listen, this is from Devin Horde. I, I hope. Horde. Howard or Horde, I'm sorry if I mispronounced your name if you're watching this video, but uh, it says, listen, I found a little marble in the burial chamber that makes Ra talk for like a minute. It's in the little pot that's tipped over. Maybe the, these are connected somehow with the bubbles you had found. So we'll have to look for it. And in fact, yeah, I'll just head that way. This should be interesting. Yeah, he didn't, he didn't specify. Oh, here it is. Just look in that one. By the window. Oh, wow. It's a, uh, it's not, it's a scroll. It's a scroll. It might okay. just be like an audio thing. Good eye, uh, good find. That's, t this is, uh, and I don't know who else, maybe somebody else found this. Uh, on the video, if anybody's watching this, um, but good eye for Devin Horde. I'm just gonna pronounce your name Horde. I'm sorry if I mispronounce it. I'll, I'll click it and see what it said, what it does. The first matter, once wielded by ancient civilizations to create wondrous empires, they mined deep into the earth, recovering as much as they could carry. Emperors, kings, priests. No leader of man could resist its touch. For with it, their societies prospered, and their kingdoms grew. But the more they used it, the more it grew. Generosity turned to greed. Benevolence turned to violence. Peace turned to war. Though they created wonders beyond comprehension, ruled civilization was built. It was never enough. The power consumed them. Soon, they cared not for their people, only for them. And so, one by one, their reigns ended, and their civilizations fell. The power that led to their rise. Okay, well that was pretty cool. Uh, I don't know if that was Ra talking. It sounded like it was the Oracle talking. The Oracle from Ancient Evil. Of course, uh -oh. this came out before that, so nobody would have known. But uh, I have subtitles on, and it didn't, it didn't show subtitles for that. The further, it looked like initially when I moved away from the pot, uh, when I backed away from it, the volume was coming from that pot after I picked up the scroll. So I think it was the Oracle, that's just my opinion, but I didn't have any subtitles to go along with it even though I had those on. So interesting, that's a cool find. I wonder if there are other scrolls around, maybe one in each area or something. Um, but I recorded it, so you can play it back and listen to it. It's just... It's interesting. I, I wonder how many other Easter eggs are around here, and right. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I'm not getting any bubbles out of this torch, but if it's an explosion, I think it is. I think the bubbles come out. So I don't know if it's connected to this or not. I don't think it is. I think it's more of an audio, an audio Easter egg, like they have with the recordings and stuff. But anyway. Uh, that's pretty cool. Scroll is down here in the oh. entrance room. Oh, that one went right to work. Uh oh. Oh wow, My yeah. <laughs> this is Reginald Barton, and I am recording this for posterity. I am not entirely sure what's happened. <laughs> There's, there's no other way to put this. One moment I was inhaling fumes in a... <laughs> I'm some sort of gladiator now? Fighting in an arena? Honestly, it doesn't make a lick of sense. <laughs> I'm accompanied by my guide, a mercenary named Bitten Bradfish. 
I'm not saying it's his fault we're here, but he is German. You can never be too sure. Are you, are you playing with that recording device? No! These creatures have us overrun! Pick up your weapon! Is it playing? He came here yep. to find the Holy Grail. They say he resides in the I did not have to travel back in time. Is this my body? Is this a dream? Am I still sitting in some cave? Enough! Give me that, you swine! Stop recording! We are going to die! Alright. Cool. Interesting.